Epic. As Thanksgiving ends, the shopping begins. Clothes for my grandparents, for my mom. We needed food and pillows. We just needed bigger size pants for her. Yep. <laughs> She's growing like a weed. During Black Friday weekend, shoppers are hunting for the best deals. They had a really great sale, six for $28. Due to COVID-19 and rising case numbers, many shoppers say this year feels different. Probably the least hectic Black Friday that I've seen because of so many people are not out as, as much anymore. It has not been the same because the crowd wasn't out yesterday. But some say it feels like a normal Black Friday weekend. But it's been kind of like the same, just like last year to me, packed out. A difference everyone is seeing this year is the safety protocols in stores, such as wearing masks and spacing out lines for social distancing. Well, it's different, it's different. The six foot spacing, uh, the mask, uh, stay safe. And that's what I've been doing. It hasn't been too bad, a little bit crowded. Uh, it's just hard to get used to wearing the mask all the time, but. I guess it's a must. And for those who say there's less people shopping this year, they're not complaining. Hey, less people around, you don't have to fight. So that, that's good. I've been thankful for that, to be around less people. It makes it easier to look for what you need. And just to be safer, it's flu season too. Yeah, Cecil Hannibal joining us live now. Shopping continuing for the rest of the weekend and into the week. You gotta wonder though, are shoppers planning some uh, other plans for taking full advantage? Yeah, Scott, that's a great question. Many shoppers say they will continue to hunt for those deals in person and online. And for those who aren't comfortable shopping in person, Cyber Monday is around the corner, and that's a chance to get similar deals, but from the comfort of your own home. Reporting in Jackson, Cecil Hannibal, 16 WAPT News.